guess what i am now i got my 4000 watch hours before even the first year on youtube how did i get monetized living in dominica i saw youtube as a data waster including instagram so i avoided them i knew that uh, this youtube you have to be patient you don't just come and disappear but when i just came on youtube my aim was to post like three times weekly back to back i could only post like once that one step i had to be praying to god to help me <laughs> then she just started and within six months she was monetized and it was like no 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 no, don't do that don't do that dominica is totally monetizable and i was like mm, it's a bit beautiful thing to reap the fruit of your label. Guess what? I am now monetized. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those who are seeing my face for the first time, my name is Precious Ayurindi. I film on faith, relationship and lifestyle all the way from the Commonwealth of Dominica. So guys, yes, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not a mistake. <laughs> I got monetized. <laughs> so guys, I got monetized. Like guys, oh my god, like thank you so much to everyone who keeps watching my videos, subscribing, liking, commenting. Hmm. Thank you so much. Today in this video, I'm going to be sharing how I got monetized, how I got my 4,000 watch time, how I got the 1,000 subscribers, like how I got all these things. And let me tell you, I got my 4,000 watch hours before even the first thing on YouTube. Like how did I do all these things? How did I get monetized living in Dominica, living in the Caribbean? Because for a long time, I thought you could not be monetized in the Caribbean. And even though I had asked one or two people here and there, I was still kind of skeptical because I felt like, you know, they've been on YouTube for a while and maybe things could have changed. So, yes. So if you want to know how all this happened, okay, okay, keep watching. <laughs> So welcome back guys so how did this youtube journey start so my youtube journey started on the 29th of september 2015 and i was on my way to dominica i think i just had one more transit or something to get to dominica by then because i got to dominica on the 30th of september oh my god almost seven years now oh i shouldn't tell you that <laughs> don't mind me guys so yes it started then and before then, I won't go on YouTube because <laughs> I saw YouTube as a data waster, including Instagram, so I avoided them. I was always on Facebook and WhatsApp status. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, and then maybe if someone just sends me a link for salmon, that's all. But when I came to Dominica, I was still just using YouTube for salmon and you know, sewing tutorials, but because of the Wi Fi, I could be on YouTube more, right? Till later on, when I finally got to know some YouTubers like Nello KK, Daniel Kwame, Kelechon Bemina, Wode Maya, and the likes of them all. I saw their struggles, I saw how they, you know, how they rose up from scratch. When I followed someone like Kamsi Namani, she was like on 5K or less, and now she's like, it's something like I saw how she grew. I was like, <laughs> it's a beautiful thing to see but something about that is that indirectly i learned i saw things i picked things i knew that i knew that uh, this youtube you have to be patient you don't just come and disappear because it, it did not work out well or on time for you with the maya it took him two years to get monetized on youtube no to get this first 1000 subscribers i don't even know got to monetize after that <laughs> immediately and now it's on a million subscribers plus okay so that's how i started this youtube journey um i actually opened the page on the 29th of september then um because i used to blog hopefully i get back into blogging and then um, i used to be on free wordpress before i moved to the paid wordpress and i used to post on faith relationship and lifestyle just like i'm posting now right on youtube but then the only thing is that when music gospel artists release their songs new songs i could really get the lyrics i post it on my site then i get the video i post on my my youtube channel but then we do all copyright at least those videos and then i also made two videos this discourage and then this vision and those videos are awesome videos are powerful videos to glory of god but i have them on private it's not because they are not good but because you know like there are some things i didn't do well my dictions and all and you know so i had to like put them private but i got 19 subscribers from those videos so i had 90 subscribers by the time i officially started my youtube channel on the 4th of may 20 
21. So I already had plan of how my YouTube channel was going to go. Like I wanted to get my 1,000 subscribers, like six months, three months, even if possible two months. <laughs> so I had watched this video from Kelly Ting Bemina, this one here, and then this one from Flo about how you can get your 4,000 watch hours, what to do and what not to do, and all those things. And one of the things you have to do is that you have to post, be consistent. You have to post like three times a week, two times a week. You have to like put certain length of videos because the lens will determine sometimes the watch time. So like, I, I don't post short videos, okay? The shortest video I have on my channel is like 12 minutes. And that's because I don't like some small watch time hours, okay? Another thing is, um, well, you have to post, even if you're posting long videos, you have to make sure it's engaging, okay? Otherwise, people will still click out irrespective. And then, you know, there's a way they do calculations so that you have an idea if you're posting this amount of times and this length, this is the idea of when you can get your 1,000, um, your 4,000 watch time or your 1,000 subscribers. But the key was just post consistently. So I was planning to post like three times a week until my laptop and my software, editing software, had issues. Okay, they were in serious issues. They were, they were having fight. In fact, <laughs> it was frustrating to take me like a day to render videos, a day to download the videos. Like I was frustrated. Like when I just came on YouTube, my aim was to post like three times weekly, back to back. I couldn't even post like once. That one step I had to be praying to God to help me. <laughs> anyway, I kept looking for better editing software and I came across Power Director. Power Director, if you're watching this video, sponsor your girl, okay? Sponsor me. <laughs> so um, I, I really love Power Director. I use the software on my phone and they have the one for the system, but I use the one on my phone and it has given me so much flexibility. You just pay like 100 EC dollar, which is like 37 US dollars per year actually not even per month and you you have the flexibility it's just easy simple to use especially if you're a newbie and i didn't learn how to edit from anybody okay nobody told me how to edit i just had to like i just watched how it is and you know they, they even have tutorials so when i just started most of the time i could not post more than once a week because what i was fighting with the software <laughs> so it's just stressful and so I couldn't, I couldn't do it. So the times I even posted three times a week or twice a week, in fact, was a win for me. <laughs> but sincerely, posting consistently and posting long and engaging videos, by long, I don't mean unnecessarily long, that's why I said engaging. Yeah, that can help you with your watch time. So I will recommend Power Director for anyone who's just starting and wants to use their phone because sincerely, it's the flexibility is beautiful and then it's easy to use and to understand. And when it comes to YouTube investments the most, I also use Epidemic Sound for my music to avoid copyright. And let me tell you guys, if you want to avoid copyright, try to use Epidemic Sound. The one time I decided that, you know what, I'm going to use Epidemic Sound to save my money, I went to source some <laughs> free music. They said copyright free. One of them eventually had copyright and I had to remove it and put one YouTube studio song there. I know what I was like, eh -eh. I'm going back to my epidemic sound, please. I pay 15 USD, which is like for one dollar and cent per month. Yes, YouTube was not paying me, but it was an investment. And also I love the peace of mind, okay, knowing that <laughs> I'm not going to wake up and see copyright all over, all over. Some people say it's copyright free just for you to come back one month later and they change their mind. <laughs> When I did Vlogmas last year, December, I didn't even post throughout the 25 days yet. I had almost like a thousand watch time from that. Like, so guys, it's very important. Like, imagine you posting back to back, back to back. There's a YouTuber I know, like she was still a small YouTuber. Well, she's still in the way a small YouTuber, but a 7K small YouTuber. <laughs> In a way, she classified as a small YouTuber. But then she just started and within six months, she was monetized. And I actually saw her join and I'm like, and I was like, how come? Like, but I could see how come. She was posting almost every day, despite having a nine to five or an eight to five, and also having a family. She has her husband as a child. When people ask like, how was she able to do it? She just says she knew what she was coming to do on YouTube. Like, she knew that <laughs> YouTube is not a joke for her. Like. So this is, was a goal, like, if you're coming on YouTube and you're saying it as just an hobby, to be remain an hobby for you, except maybe one of your videos just does well or something. So you have to see YouTube as a job or see it as something very important to you. Like, even till now, the lady does not like, she gives back to back and that really helps you to watch time and a subscriber count. So you guys, you need to like, be consistent. And right now, maybe right now, you don't have the opportunity or you just cannot be that consistent then yeah, it's okay. Just make sure that you're posting long and engaging videos at least that will give you 
good watch time sometimes i post short videos but they still give me that watch time within that range that i need so yes that's what i would say and advice but that was my journey so this youtube street you can't give up okay sometimes you want to just give up but someone like with Maya, it took him one no two years to actually get 1000 subscribers and right now is at a million plus subscribers like guys you just have to be patient on this youtube streets and just make sure you avoid copyrighted music like avoid them avoid them <laughs> and also you post consistently engaging videos and yeah my god's grace and god on your side you're going to get there so how did i get monetized first of all i got to achieve the 1000 subscriber count on the 10th of september 2022 okay which was just <laughs> Which day was that? I like I just literally saw it casually and I was like, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> anyway, I was so excited about it. Then I saw the option on my YouTube studio that okay, you have three steps to get monetized. Three steps before you get monetized. The first one was to accept the terms and conditions. Of course, I accepted. The second one was to fill in your AdSense or get your AdSense. But I already had an AdSense that I used when I was blogging, right? But I use Dominica as my address and I always just thought that Dominica is not monetizable so I just felt like I needed to delete it so I deleted it and then I was looking for US address about shout out to Gabrielle she's a YouTuber and then she put me through okay this is what she did so I, I didn't actually know that there was another option to actually use Dominica address that is work so I sent messages to some Dominican YouTubers earlier on like a day before but I was still expecting responses and that was when GK, shout out to GK, he's a Dominican YouTuber, guys. You guys should please check his channel out in case you're not subscribed to his channel. So, just as I was about pressing submit, you know, those words like just chill, don't yet submit because I was waiting for another friend of mine to ask him something for like I press the submit, right? And then those were like, don't press it yet. And just like a few minutes later, I just saw his message as GK and it was like, no, 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 don't do that, don't do that. Dominica is totally monetizable. And I was like, mm. I was like, maybe things have changed a bit. And I was like, you know, that it's totally monetizable. It gave me proof and all those things. And it just took me through the you know, direction I should go. And yes, the Caribbean is monetizable, guys. Yes, it's totally monetizable adsense accept the address so i filled the form with my address here in dominica and then i had to wait so i'd watched some videos on youtube someone's like you got accepted into the adsense program in like a few hours like maybe seven hours so i was like okay let me wait so i waited and yeah like within seven eight hours they about like they accepted me into the program i was excited so automatically to move to the next step which is youtube reviewing your your youtube channel so already to avoid any issue just avoid make sure that you don't have copyright um videos or music or whatever on your youtube channel so i totally tried i totally don't have all those because i use epidemic sound so yes, and since I've watched videos, this were like they became YouTube partners, that means they got monetized in like one day, one person said one day, another person said three days, like all those things, right? Where a lot of people were like three days. And but YouTube wrote like within a week. So I was like, okay, let me give them 12 hours first. 12 hours came, nothing. I was like, I'm giving people one day, one day, show yourself. <laughs> one day they did not show. <laughs> So while I was just like the next day, I was like, good, and this thing just pop up like, and just at the end of the service, like I just saw it like, I was like, you know, when you cannot even scream, but then your mind, you are screaming. <laughs> I was so excited and I'm still so excited now, guys. Like I'm so excited. Like, thank you guys so much for always watching my videos. Thank you for everyone who has been helpful. Shout out to my mom for, you know, she's always like, oh, I got something to subscribe to the channel, other things. Thank you thank you thank you so much i don't mention names so i don't skip any name so but thank you guys so much and that was on thursday the 15th of september 2022 okay even though i said other steps to you know to complete with because you still need like to make ten dollars be able to like do certain things then hundred dollars is a threshold before you can withdraw your money like you have to get at least hundred dollars every month to be able to withdraw Otherwise, they will owe the money till it's hundred dollars they send to you. And now tax is there. And even if you are in a non, even if you are not in the US, you can still fill the tax form. There are two types, okay? So there's a type for those that are not in the US to fill, and you don't really need anything much for that one. Sincerely, 
it wasn't your name, you're this, you're that. Like sincerely, like nothing, nothing extra. Like I thought, I thought like I would need so many things, but sincerely, nothing extra, nothing serious like that. So guys, that's how I go monetize. So if you guys are seeing ads right now, oh my god, please don't skip the ads. Watch the ads for those on YouTube. Even if you're not on YouTube, I feel like this is still going to be helpful for whatever for whatever field you are in. Um, so I would still say be consistent. You know, put videos that are engaging and also maybe long, long. I'm saying maybe because you can put engaging and short and to still do very well and give you good watch time, but just target long, right? Then if you can invest in a good camera or quality camera, it doesn't have to be like the main camera, it could be your phone. Do so please, because quality is very important at least. You don't have to break the bank, but at least it should be a quality that people can watch. And also if you can invest in mic, that would be good because you always say that sound is even more important than the, the video. So and even if you cannot invest in a mic right now, at least just make sure you speak loud when you're talking and your lighting is important. You if you are using natural lights, just make sure that it's at a good time. Otherwise, get a ring light and all those things. Just keep being consistent don't give up like <laughs> guys don't give up okay all those hard work by god's grace is going to pay and also don't be scared to share your videos even if there are people who are like oh I don't share it to me okay leave them out of it share to others okay don't be scared to share your work out there and little by little you get better okay it's consistency don't just say oh i'm not good at this so i can't do it no you build yourself up okay um, like there's this YouTuber Vivian Okeze. I always loved the way she did. Meanwhile, she didn't even learn it anyway. Okay, so there's a particular I did she did one time. Like I really loved it and wanted to know how she did it, but I couldn't. Until one day, I was just able to figure it out. So guys, I'm monetized. When you see the hats, watch these ads. Please watch them, watch them, watch them. It's a beautiful thing to reap the fruit of your labor. Okay, so. Yeah, thank you guys so much. So if you guys want me to drop more tips for those on YouTube, on I know how to get by and all these things, please let me in the comment section. I'll also leave the link to these channels I mentioned in the description box below. And another thing is that I would like to go live to celebrate all this. So if you guys would want me to go live, please let me know in the comment section and if you'll be there, okay? <laughs> if I go live, it'll be my first time going live on YouTube. So you guys let me know if you want me to go live on YouTube, okay? Let me know in the comment section. So guys, please don't forget to always watch the ads. Don't skip the ads, okay? For those same ads, we don't see ads in Dominica. So uh, if you're seeing ads and you're in Dominica, please let me know. But we don't see ads when watching videos in Dominica, so I don't know how that's going to play out with my channel. But right now, it's important that we watch the ads. I wouldn't have been able to get to this place without you, but yes, you. So thank you so much. Please go ahead, like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Share this video to your friends and family. Subscribe to this channel if you are new here. Hey, <laughs> turn on your notification bell and no comment below and i'll see you guys in the next one if you have any questions for me please drop it in the comment section so from me to you it is bye, bye.